In this video, I'll show you how to activate and how to use the Wi-Fi Direct feature of your Epson EcoTank printer. This way you'll be able to connect directly to your smartphone or your computer without the need to connect the printer to a internet router. So let's get started. I know not all Epson EcoTank printers are the same, but most of them have a screen over here. If yours have a screen, what you need to do is to go through the settings here until you get through Wi-Fi setup. If you do not see Wi-Fi setup in this main menu, you need to go in the settings, press OK, and then navigate until you see network settings and press OK. Then press the right side arrow until you see Wi-Fi setup. It's the same exact thing. If you go from the main menu or if you go from the settings, this is where you're going to end up. So now we have Wi-Fi recommended, but if we press once on the right side arrow, we have Wi-Fi direct, and this is what we want. So we're going to press OK, then press OK once more, another time OK, and then you're going to select other methods, which is uh, this left side arrow. Press once on this left side arrow. And we have two choices, iOS, if you want to connect to your iPad or iPhone, or other OS devices. This is if you have an Android phone or if you have a PC Windows or Mac computer. So I'll select this option, press OK, then go down. So here is the network name. This is how you, the Wi-Fi, this is how you'll find this printer. Just open your Wi-Fi settings on your computer or Android smartphone, and you should find direct Epson and with the name of your model. Then go down, and here you have the password, because once you will try to connect to this Wi-Fi network, it will ask you for a password, and here we go. This is where you need to go. Once you're connected, simply press OK, you can press home and start connecting your device to your printer and start printing. So this is it. This is how easy it is to connect your device directly to your Epson EcoTank printer. Yeah, I hope this was useful. If so, please leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.